best way to win an award is to do an amazing piece of work. And that revolves around two things. It's about having a great idea that you really execute in the kind of best way possible. Come up with an inspiring brief which you can take into creative development and really ignite the imaginations of the creative department. If this thing at Contagious that we talk about the no media metric, you know, if this idea had no media budget behind it, is it still good enough and strong enough that people would pick it up themselves and push it out there? You've just got to do something that really kind of amplifies the idea and that, that excites people and allows people to kind of get behind it. And the work that really feels like it's got a, a fresh insight, they've really kind of understood the audience but find, found a new dimension to the category. Know your audience and the audience in award entries is the judge. Judges can be quite time poor, they can be quite cynical in some cases. It can be upsetting if your work's not good enough to win an award, but what can be even more upsetting is if your work is great but the awards entry fails to reflect that. Anything that you do that makes their life more difficult is going to reduce your chances of, of being taken seriously. They're sitting in a room bombarded by all this content and I think they just want to get to the idea very quickly. Now you've got to look at the, at the precise um, demands of, of, of each award scheme and understand what they're trying to recognise. If you can tell a compelling story of how that campaign came about, its effect and its results, then you're on to a winner. You know, this, is, you know, this is why it looks the way it does. This is why the, the, key, the key decisions were taken in the, in the construction of the work. Uh, why you did it, what the challenge was, and why, it's, why it is clever, why it's an interesting idea, but don't use lots of superlatives. Sometimes people kind of try and flesh out mediocre ideas by trying to make them feel kind of more significant and effective than they actually were. The company may be great, but that's not the point of the awards entry. The point is to let the work speak for itself. So don't be thinking that you know, an award equals a big expense. An award equals a beautiful idea, a great idea that's been just wonderfully executed in a way that really resonates with this audience. So keep it concise, keep it, keep it brief, and focus on the goals of the project, how you went about trying to achieve those goals and the results you achieved. And that's the way that you'll put yourself in a position to really stand out from the crowd. Just try and keep it snappy and to the point, but don't forget that advertising is there to sell. And if the piece hasn't sold and hasn't worked, then you know you shouldn't really be entering it.